Good morning, Patriots. Welcome back to Rex Pines TV. I'm Giselle Adams. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today is September 24th, 2024. Now let's go learn about an important Hispanic figure with Hadassah. Thank you, Giselle. Bienvenidos, Patriots. Today in Hispanic Heritage, we'll be spotlighting Pablo Picasso. Pablo Picasso was a famous painter and sculptor. He drew his first ever oil painting at the age of eight, and from then on, he kept drawing and making sculptures. He was famous for his abstract view of the world. One of his most famous paintings was the Guernica, which was one of his very extravagant abstract paintings and one of his most famous sculptures was the maquette for guitar. His technique was groundbreaking for sculptures. This is also inspirational. Maybe I'll be a painter one day. And now let's check in with Zarmel for today's lunch. Thank you, Adasa. Hey, Patriots, today's tasty lunch is sweet and sour chicken, brown rice, turkey and cheese wrap, seasoned Italian veggies, red bell peppers, garden size salad, ranch dressing, sliced pears, and yarn chasing milk. Tomorrow breakfast is frosted cinnamon rolls, Lucky Charms, string cheese, fresh bananas, and 100% apple juice. Students, please keep in mind the lunch menu can change at any time and to always let your teachers know if you're gonna be receiving lunch today. Bon appetit, now let's head back with yourself. Thank you, Zermel, that sounds stupendous. Patriots, make sure to spit out any gum that you have before entering the building. Let's keep our environment clean. Oh, and phones, make sure they're off and in your bags at all times. And wear only a school jacket or sweater. K through fourth will have waffles and dress down if they do 25 Imagine Math and Core 5 lessons. And 5th through 8th, we'll have a Sunday party with Just Down in return for 25 Imagine Math and iReady Reading. Make sure to do your challenge for these rewards. Also, the top three users will also enjoy the fun. Trials for Girls Basketball will be next week on October 1st. It will be for 5th through 8th graders. You must have a completed sports packet, a pair of athletic shoes, and a 2.5 GPA or higher. Make sure to be at the gym at 3.45 to 5.30 p.m. I wish you luck! Guess what? Boys soccer trials are also on October 1st. To try out, you will need a completed sports packet, a pair of athletic shoes, and a 2.5 GPA or higher. Don't forget to practice. I hope you get in. Tomorrow's family night. The estimated arrival time will be from 2.30 and ending at 9 p.m. Let's have a blast with friends and family. K-2 second will continue to take their math fluency test till Friday the 27th. We wish you luck. Today, our girls volleyball team will have a game against Aces. It will be at 4 p.m. Let's reach out and support them. Now let's view the weather charts with Camilo. Thank you, Giselle. Howdy, Patriots. Today's weather is 91 degrees Fahrenheit with partly cloudy skies. It's a good day to play in the park. And other weather news. Fall favorites like pumpkin, sweet potatoes, cranberries, and pumpkin spice latte from Starbucks are not only tasty, but are also healthy for your well-being. First off, pumpkin and sweet potatoes provide vitamin C and many other vitamins that help your bones, skin, and blood vessels. Cranberries strengthen your immune system and promote a healthy heart. Pumpkin spice lattes have cinnamon, allspice, cloves, ginger, and nutmeg that helps your body all around. Wow, I never thought that fall was that healthy. Thank you, Camilo. Today's birthday boys and girls are Janaska Darbuz, Makaya Harris, Zion Dimash, Aliyah Valerio, Aliyah Valerio, Imani Mansfield, Laurent Lima, Lima Quinta, and Alicia Tukpasan. Happy birthday, let's go back to Giselle. Thank you, Catherine. Patriots, here are your past expectations. It represents, present yourself positively, act kindly towards others, treat the school's environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. Congrats to Ms. Sands, Ms. Cavalita, Ms. Nelson, and Ms. Arnold for getting the correct answer to yesterday's daily challenge, which was, where are Cricket's ears located? The correct answer was on their legs. Now for today's daily challenge. Daily challenge. How many cats do you need for a colony? Teachers, please send your answers to pines.renaissance at gmail.com before 9 a.m. in order for your answers to be reviewed. Everyone at RPTV would like to wish you all a terrific Tuesday. Have a great day!